Hey guys, I got a new video for you today and I wanted to go ahead and showcase this knife here. I've actually already done a video review on this. If you guys are interested on in seeing that, I will place it right up here. You can go ahead and click on that and I'll probably leave a link at the end of this video. So this is the Lead Duck. Um, this is a fixed blade knife from the company Outdoor Edge. It's a really interesting looking knife. Obviously the name comes from the way that this handle looks like. It looks like the head of a duck with the beak and stuff like that. The lanyard hole being the eye. Um, this is a, a really cool knife. It's a small little fixed plate knife. You could carry it as a neck knife if you wanted to, but it does come with a clip. The clip is able to rotate um, you know, all 360 degrees. So if you wanna carry it horizontal or vertical on your belt, you can go ahead and do that. You can go ahead and remove the screws and swap it out. So if left-handed or right-handed, and then you do have this little locking mechanism here, which you know keeps the knife in place. So you use your thumb right here to unlock that and then push off. And here is the knife. Nice rubberized handle, and then um, the little beak of the duck actually fits right there, um, right after my third finger, and my in between my third and fourth finger. And then you do have jimping right at the top here, which your thumb locks in very, very nicely. Really, really comfortable hold. Now, why am I showing you this knife if I've already done a video on it? Well, because I actually came across this. Basically, it is a very similar knife, but instead of it being the lead duck, this is actually the lead hawk. So um, that is a uh, worn cliff blade there. So they went ahead and named it the Le Hawk. I left the price tag here, $34.95, and that is because I actually came across this knife at my local 5.11 store. Um, I hadn't seen it at any of the other retailers that normally carry this. I know, um, I wanna say Academy Sports, if you guys don't have those in your area, it's like a sports store, kind of like a Dick's or a um, Bass Pro Shop. Uh, it's just a, another brand. They carry Outdoor Edge as well, but I know they have the Le Duck because I've seen it there, but I had not seen this one here. So I went ahead and picked it up because I really like the Le Duck. So why not have a Warncliffe version of that? So let's take a look at the back. It gives you a little bit of information about it. It says all-purpose multi-carry knife. So a couple of the specs, it, the blade is 2.9 inches. So again, it's a sub three inch blade. Overall length is 6.2 inches. Steel is eight CR14 stainless steel with black stone coating. Um, handle is rubberized TPR. The sheath is polypropylene. It does come with a black paracord lanyard. So you can go ahead and may, um, either do a, uh, a lanyard for it or if you want to wear it around your neck as a neck knife and then it comes in at three ounces so very very lightweight especially if you're going to be wearing it on your neck let me see if i can pull this guy off of here without having to use i'm going to go ahead and use the other knife to get this knife out of there so cut the plastic here so i can get the knife out all right does have a protective sleeve here, which is nice. And then I will cut the sheath out. And get it all the way out. Let's see. There we go. Now I don't normally carry neck knives, so um, the paracord I'll probably save or use it for something else. But I do really like the sheath of the Lead Duck, so um, it looks like the sheath is similar to that one. So that is great. Yep, there it is. So I'll set this off to the side. We will put this guy back in the sheath. And we will take a look at the Lead Hawk here. So again, same basic grip for this guy because it does have that um, kind of beak there that rest in between my third and fourth finger. You do have the jimping. Main difference is this jimping actually comes up a little bit further. Um, let me see if we can see them side by side. Yep, so as you can see there, the lead duck on the right, the lead hawk on the, on the left. The jimping does come up a little bit more. So um, if you did want to um, kind of grip it up here more and do some finer cuts or something like that, obviously with that kind of Warncliffe style blade, flat blade right there, it'll lend itself better to do that, especially push cuts and stuff like that. It does come to a very, very wicked point there, um, even though this one has a pretty um, pointy point as well. Uh, the belly here is obviously better for slicing versus um, this one is more of a flat, um, flat edge on this one here. So you do have the 
name right here, LaHawk. 8 CR14 MOV as well. And then the eye is actually a lanyard hole also. So great, great knife here. Uh, the sheath very similar. So you can go ahead and uh, take out the, or move the locking mechanism there and it locks in place. It doesn't come out. It doesn't rattle while you have it in there, which is nice. And then you do have the clip here, which rotates 360 degrees. So that is really, really awesome. So let's get this guy in the sheath as well, so you guys can see them side by side. So if you are familiar with the lead duck and you like that style knife, uh, maybe you have one or you've seen it or something like that, uh, keep your eye out for the Le Hawk here um, because I think you will definitely like it. If you um, if you don't have one of these and you want to try them out, now you have a couple of different options, which is nice. Again, the Le Duck here with the uh, original blade and then the Le Hawk with the uh, Warncliffe style blade. Let me see if I can get these um, kind of lined up. I want to say that the Le Hawk is going to be a little bit longer, just a tad, um, not too much. But again, what did they say the overall length on this was? 6.2 inches. So I would almost say that the Le Duck is probably like six inches, and then the Le Hawk is about three or 6.2 inches. So great, great options for small um, EDC blade carry. Again, lightweight at three ounces. The, you barely feel this. I think the sheath weighs almost as much as the knife does um so you know this is a really nice utilitarian knife again for 34.95 you know you i i wouldn't mind beating this guy up opening up boxes you know cutting rope and stuff like that or pretty much doing anything that a small little um you know fixed blade knife will let you do so again it's good to always have options so i'm glad that outdoor edge actually came out with um, another option on this particular style of knife because I really have enjoyed this one since I've had it. Again, if you guys are interested, go ahead and check out that video. But there it is, just a quick look at the new Lehawk from Outdoor Edge. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.